Good afternoon and welcome to the TPM 4 Minute Friday where we show you tips and techniques that will help your everyday tasks. My name is Dana Rice and I am the Civil 3D and InfraWorks Applications Engineer. Today I want to show you a command that is actually a Map 3D command but it is run through Civil 3D. And this command is called Drawing Cleanup and what it does is it helps you clean up drawings that uh, have multiple lines on top of one another. For instance, this line here, when I go to select what I think is one line, you can see that I've actually selected two entities. Same with this line here, that's actually two, and it's one line or polyline on top of one another. This drawing is full of this situation and we frequently run into drawings that are like this usually through no fault of our own. Now what you may not know is that you can access Map 3D through Civil 3D if you come up here to the upper left and change the workspace to planning and analysis the interface changes to the Map 3D interface I'm still in Civil 3D. I didn't shut it down and open a different program for my desktop. All I did was change the workspace. So now what I'm going to do is activate the Tools ribbon under the Planning and Analysis workspace and here's the command I'm going to show you today, Drawing Cleanup. I'm going to leave it on Select All, but you can see that you can select entities manually. You can select by layer let me go ahead and click next. I'm going to select uh, delete duplicates but you can see all of the various actions available and by clicking add I'm selecting the action so this command will do that action as well as I'm going to go ahead and erase any zero length objects. When I hit next um, I'm going to leave it on default as you can see but only those two actions that I selected will be performed. So now I'm going to click finish and you can see down here, let me hit the F2 button to bring up my dialog box of the text. 23 objects have been deleted. And just a little test, let me try and select this one object and yes, that is now one line or one polyline. And there you have it. Thank you for spending a bit of your time with TPM and our 4-Minute Friday. My name is Dana Rice, and have an excellent day.